Hello my friend, it is I, Vadim. Today's topic is NVIDIA RTX 3060. Enough information about it has leaked for me to finally create this video. It should help you decide if you want to wait and save up for the RTX 3060 or buy something now. In this video, I will go over the specs, release date, price and FPS performance by showing you how 3060 will compare to other graphics cards in games. Let's start with the specs. 3060 should come with 6GB of GDDR6 video memory and power consumption around 180 watts. Some sources suggest that 3060 may be released in November, but don't be surprised if you won't see it until early 2021. I post regular updates on such matters on Twitter, so follow me at iVadimTech to stay up to date. The price is expected to be between $300 and $400 depending on the model. As you probably know, some board partners can easily add another hundred or more to the price tag just for little things, such as better cooling or factory overclock. Now to the good stuff – performance. A recent photo from a Galax meeting suggests that RTX 3060 performs on par with RTX 2080 and approaches the 2080 Super territory. As we have seen time and again, companies like to use the best-case scenario to market their GPUs versus the previous generation. I do my best to be a realist, so I put RTX 3060 between 2070 Super and regular 2080. This card will be able to handle most games at 1080p on maxed out settings, of course with exception of a few odd ones like Microsoft Flight Simulator. That is why I decided to show you mock benchmark charts of RTX 3060 performance in games at 1440p and 4K. As you can see, 3060 is expected to handle 1440p quite well, well enough to be able to play competitive titles such as Rainbow Six Siege on a 1440p 144Hz monitor. 3060 may be the card that will convince more people to switch from 1080p for the first time. That is all for now, I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. And while you're there, hit the like button and subscribe for more. Click on the bell icon to turn on the notifications. Also, follow me on Twitter at iVadimTech to see even more content. It was I, Vadim, thank you for watching and have a great day.